The holiday shopping season is upon us, and after a tough year for brick-and-mortar stores, retailers are eager for business. Many are promoting massive sales to lure shoppers. I think that brick-and-mortars believe that the best way to compete against online retailers is to slash prices. But competing this way is misguided. I believe that traditional retail can never match the price comparing capabilities of the internet. Instead, Chatterjee says stores should do more to entice customers by focusing on their core competencies, one-on-one -on -one customer service, sensory stimulating in-store experiences, and the promise of instant gratification. My first recommendation to brick and mortar retailers is to cultivate salespeople who can provide impeccable service. The human touch is key. These salespeople need to be ready and willing to spend time with shoppers. They need to be resourceful in helping the customers find the perfect gift. Next, Chatterjee says retailers must make their stores more inviting, and they must make smarter investments in inventory to assure immediate customer satisfaction. Shopping can be exciting, surprising, and energizing. Retailers need to engage customer senses by creating visually appealing displays and by evoking the holiday spirit. They basically need to make shopping feel special and fun. Retailers need to make smarter investments in inventory to assure instant gratification. There is nothing more frustrating than venturing all the way to a store only to find that the sweater you so covet is not available in your size. Finally, says Chatterjee, retailers must stop the constant markdowns. They are unnecessary and counterproductive. Deep discounting on an ever-expanding set of items does not help long-term sales. In fact, it might hurt them. Price discounts slash the very resources retailers need to differentiate from online retail. Service, in-store experience, and instant gratification. Retailers must recognize that the more discounts they give, the fewer resources they would have for long-term investment.